Hey guys, welcome back to another fun episode of Animal Funny Fur Friend Reactions. So let's get right into number one. Happy Tuesday, everybody. Let's get into number one. Oh, he's like, shave my fur. <laughs> He's really like you. Oh. Now it. Now it. Now it. Oh. Little kitty. Just <laughs> squishing. <laughs> Let me take that toy and you. Nope. <laughs> oh my god. I'm cheering for the dog. I love it. Oh. Oh. Big yawns. Big, big yawns. This dead. <laughs> That's cute. I love when everyone, he like lifted up the dog in the window and everyone cheered for the dog. That was adorable. Uh, dancing dog, the big yawn. That was, um, that was that white dog though. I don't know if he, if he was just hurt or older or whatever, but I hope he's okay. Okay, on to number two. Okay, number two, here we go. Oh, okay. Fine, I'm in. <laughs> There you go. It took a long time. Dog said you ain't falling on me. <laughs> oh, she did. And fall. He's oh. like, hey, wait, listen. Let me, listen to me. Let me explain this. <laughs> My dog got a little too excited when the doorbell rang. Oh. That's, that's a project. So my other dog is making fun of my corgi short legs. That's nice. Like, okay, I'll keep going, I'll keep going. Oh my god. Stop it. Stop. Be aware of dog. Oh my he's so tidy. Oh has he even watched? How many how many times have you watched this? Yes. <laughs> he's just excited. <laughs> Like, leave me alone. Look of shock when you realize you're not home alone. And there was a page dedicated to orange cat energy. Oh yeah. Who's gonna win? Who's gonna Oh good boy! Yay, he won! The last little bark is priceless. I wish I could share this with you, but you could go watch it. It it has like the account funny cute dog. Um, I just don't want to get copyrighted, just in case. So that's all. That's why I haven't been putting anything with sound on. Dog got fooled. <laughs> oh, he <you> didn't. <laughs> We've seen this one a bunch of times, but I will always rewatch this one. <laughs> Cause he's like, no, I want more time. With I'm surprised he didn't try to like run and bolt back to the beach. He's just like, no, maybe if I don't move, we won't go. Home and we'll have to stay at the beach. <laughs> That's <clears throat> probably what he was trying to do. Okay, on. Let me know which one so far has been your favorite. So on to number three. Okay, number three. Here we go. Did she just? She said, "Sit, dude." Oh, not sitting. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Dog's like, I want to be fed. Oh. <laughs> Please we're poor. <laughs> is that you saying that or is that the dog saying that they're poor? <laughs> that was pitch perfect. Oh again you could go check out that's how I leave the people up there so you could go see. Which is why I'm which why is my dog so toxic? <laughs> I gave my dog a butt trim and he was so offended. Oh <laughs> <that's> <laughs> Does anyone else's dog? Yep, probably. The quietest room taught my dog to whisper. 
Aww. That's so sweet. But yeah, the, do- the titles of, or the names of these TikToks, you can go check out. His biggest fear is bare feet. Oh, no, no. He's not happy with you. New dog sound unlocked. Oh. <laughs> Just don't ever do that again. That's it. He's going to take you, he's going to take your finger off. No. Anyways. Okay, on to the next. Okay, here we go. On to the third one. No, sorry, fourth one. Dig, 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 dig a hole, dig a hole. Until the water comes through. And then he's like, why is there water? Gotta keep digging. Yeah, I paused it just to see I wasn't replaying it. Go away, water, you're ruining my hole. Sploosh, take this water. Oh my gosh. (laughs) He's like... Why is this water here? It's ruining my hole. My hole. That's funny. I love it. Um, do your dogs love to dig a lot? My one of mine does. She will dig, and there is no stopping her. Literally, we do everything we can to stop, but it is very hard. Okay, on to number five. Okay, I think we're on. Number five. Okay, here we go. Oh, look at all those dogs just enjoying the beach. That would be that would be such a dream. I would run in the water with them. Oh. Are dogs allowed on? Is there lots of is there lots of places in this world where dogs are allowed on the beach, but freely not? Um, this might be. I think we played twice, but that's okay. Um. I'm curious if you, if there's any, because I know like lots of our provincial parks, we can't have dogs on the beach at all, like not even on a leash. So I'm just because lots of people don't pick up after their dogs and like they don't clean up after their dogs. And so I think some people like it kind of ruins it for others who do that stuff and they don't, and they want to keep their beach as clean as possible. So I'm curious what kind of rules are there around your, um, your places where there is a beach where there is those rules i'm curious let me know in the comments below okay on to the next one i tried to do a lot of beach theme but um i always think like you don't want to like watch a whole bunch of this dogs being at the beach where it's like very similar behavior so i thought i would do a little bit of a beach theme but also add some other thing other animal reactions in it so our dog's first ever beach day did not go as planned Let's see. Nope. I don't know about this, Dad. <laughs> Oops, almost got me. Really does not like the water. Not today, not today. And you know what? That's okay. It's not for every animal. Um, this one girl said something, and I thought this was really cool, um, because I didn't think of it, but dogs that are selective, of course it's okay for them to be selective, because obviously, just like us, we don't like there's people we don't like in this world doesn't mean we have we're forced to be friends with them so no one forces us to be friends with people we're not we don't really like or we don't connect with why should we do the same thing why should we be forcing animals to be friends with other animals that they don't prop they don't connect with so i thought that was a really good uh eye opener like okay well you know what if they're not good friends then it's not gonna work out sadly it doesn't have to work out all the time um, but that's not saying go and put your dog in a home or anything like that and abandon them. It's just saying you gotta figure out the next steps. Anyways, like as in maybe separating them or or just letting them kind of, you know, keep apart from each other. It's okay. Okay, anyways, uh, that's if they live together. But yeah, moving on. Okay, on to number seven. Here we go never seen a white moose before have you i don't think i ever have this is really neat <laughs> i love how he's just playing with that toy car and he's like almost afraid of it but he's like just still chilling it's interesting when wildlife interact with human life and then like and nothing happens but yes it can get scary so of course I always take 
cautious of those wildlife animals because they are da- they can be dangerous for sure. But some of them are just like I don't know, they're just very chill with, with human beings. And maybe because they're like, say, for example, you're at a camp and you've been there for a long time, and this one bear always comes around. Well, eventually they would get used to you, and eventually you wouldn't have to worry about them being dangerous to you unless something does happen in that time frame like someone tried to hunt them and now they're angry or or whatever that is or they tried to steal their food or, or whatever angers a bear or an, or another wildlife animal anyways that is an interesting and now we are on the very last one okay guys let's get into the very last one oh oh no their paws are very like um like um very slim i did not realize that about moose and the other one oh i don't think he's still there i think he just kind of ditched oh felt feel bad for the moose there he's just kind of stuck he's like i don't want to fall in obviously so that would really hurt that moose for sure maybe even you know be unalived unfortunately i don't know for sure but yeah he's got it he's got it i think i hope i just hope i see i hope the outcome is better um for that moose and he survived i'm sure he did i don't know like ice isn't as strong i'm pretty sure moose are stronger and can break through ice pretty quick that is it for me my friends um i have a lot more to go through for the this week and i'm super excited you guys have a lovely rest of your evening and we'll chat soon bye now